of a dude. <laughs> it is one in the morning, and I am the I am playing Mon Mizzou. So welcome to episode six, because I yeah I I need to go to bed. All right, you might notice that it is later in the day. This is because there's nothing I can really do that's entertaining on Sunday. So I was going to off camera start cutting wood and selling it so that on Monday we can buy a bunch of stuff for the sugar shack and the cars. Anyway, this thing ran out of gas and it was Sunday so I I couldn't couldn't get more. But other than that, it's splendid. Uh, there are some car parts in the woods, so we're gonna go grab it of those and we're gonna bring the truck So we can actually bring them home and I'm gonna bring this poutine which we're almost out of poutine by the way This is a no bueno situation and before we go I should probably call my mom watch her still not love me Oh, she does. Yay. I'm loved again. All right, let's go If you notice my voice is gone, that's because it's not here. What? Uh, I think if if we get stuck out here in the middle of the night and we can't come home because it's uh it's really dark out, then there's a slight chance that my sleep schedule in the game might be just as fricked as my sleep schedule in real life. All right, so I'll have to remember where these things are. They're uh somewhere for sure. Ah, this. This is where it splits. So we're gonna go this way. The other way is the junkyard, but we haven't unlocked that yet. We're going this way, where there's a cabin that we can buy. But we obviously can't buy it yet, which is exactly why I'm gonna go on the property and grab some car parts before I buy it, because I'm impatient. And no, it's not stealing, because... Um, Storyline, I'm supposed to get them anyway. I don't know where this cabin is. I want to say it's like supposed to be close found it so i might have to walk over there unless i can figure out a way to get over this ditch if we look at the map we're currently um we are currently um um six hours later i think we went the wrong way all right cool so um we're gonna go back <laughs> because i went the uh the wrong way um my bad this is the perfect moment to mention that this is the very last mon Bazoo episode that's going to be posted on this channel if you're enjoying it and you want to do it but it's not ending if you want to continue watching this this <laughs> The series is going to be continuing on my second channel, which will be linked in the description as well as it is on my homepage. Is this the spot that I have to go? I think this is it. Woo! What's that? Oh, oh, let's go. We got a welded differential and we got a bumper, an off road one too. I would put that on it, but that's just adding extra weight. But do I care? No. Now, I want to say there's probably something down here, but no, I don't know. Probably not, dude. Oh, what's that? <gasps> Buggy parts. Yeah. <laughs> All right. The nice thing is that the garage is being built, right? That means that we're actually going to have an opportunity to have a place to actually work on these vehiculars that I am obtaining. If I lose any of these by having them fly out of the back of my truck, then that sucks. All right, we made it home just in time. Um, I didn't mean to shift it into four-wheel drive, but honestly, I'm not complaining because four-wheel drive, am I right or am I right? Because I know I'm wrong. So this will be going in this car. You know, we could put this on here. I don't know what size bolts this thing takes. Could put that on there. That'd be pretty cool. Let's see. Can I put, just pop this on here? Nice. Let's go. This is going to be such a fun little toy. Stick this back in the fridge. Just like that. Physics. And let's see if in the morning we are fortunate enough to have a finished uh, garage. Is the garage complete? No, it is not. All right, let's head to town. Talk to some people and purchase some stuff. Oh, yes, sir. Now let's go to the snack shack and get me some food, bruh. I can't read what days those are, but I'm assuming 
that that means it's not opening till 12. Uh, you always want to make sure you flip over your cans sideways when you fill them because if you don't, then they're not sideways and you don't want that. You don't even always have to close these things. Like you can see it's full of gas, but like that doesn't mean you have to close it either. You can, you can throw it in just the way that it is. I don't remember what I want. Oh yeah, pruners. We need the pruners. This would be really good to have. This is really nice right here. Let's get two of these because I know that we're going to need them. A dent repair kit. If I remember correctly, we definitely need this. We'll worry about these types of things when the time comes to it. But, you know, it'll have to happen a little bit later. Let's go buy some maple syrup supplies. Uh, so we want this. I actually want to get two of these. One of them might fly out of the truck on the way home. <laughs> we might as well grab some more of these. It's so expensive, but... We do need it if we want to make money, so we might as well. I'm really cutting it close with my food, bruh. <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> harvest basket. I need this to harvest stuff. Now that I've spent my lifelong earnings of savings on random things that I probably won't use for a long time, it's debatably time to go home because I really want to buy food. But you know what? We'll go home. We can come back. Maybe when we come back, we'll bring the other car because the other car is cool let's get some basic maintenance thing done on um the kong i don't i only want to put like ha actually let's fill up the wood splitter first so that we know how much is left and then we'll leave this over here so that we remember to grab that let's see if we can harvest these potatoes let's go achievements are being made now let's do some maintenance with this thing so the first thing i kind of want to do with the rust repair kits I want to put one of them, I want to use it on this. It's a little premature to do it right now, but um, it looks good and it'll look even better now for when I finish it. Where should I use this? It, the car really be looking splendid, <laughs> you know? We can put it on the roof. The roof really did look like the worst part. And then we'll take the dent repair kit and we'll make this look much better. I, I didn't read that, but it'll probably be fine. Oh, okay, okay. I, I, I probably already made it worse. <laughs> Alright, I believe this is the last Bonnie b body panel. We're all good now. Why does it look like that's dented? But I can't do anything about it. <gasps> I can fix this too. I'm gonna make this truck shiny as frick. Alright, nice. We're done with this for now. Cool, we've made some uh, improvements. Uh, let's, um, let's put this bumper on it. I really want to do that. It actually looks pretty cool. I, I think this thing be looking nice. Uh, it looks, it honestly looks really good. Like, you know, it, it, it's, it's got its like, you know, rough sides, but it's good. It's good. Well, apparently I still have coffee in here. I, I forgot I had those. We can just put those to the side for now. We don't really need them. Oh, it's so friggin' slow, dude. This thing needs a new engine. That, that's all I can say for this thing. It needs a new engine for real. I am here for food. Actually, <laughs> Who needs that? I have windows. <laughs> Let's fill up on gas first, and then I want to I want to grab some more rust removal removal kits. Now let's just make it kind of nice. Oh yeah, and we can remove the the rust on the bumper as well. Alright, I really think that the things that we've just done to it have really helped to add that extra 5 horsepower. Used to be able to buy colored tint here. I bet you it's probably going to be in that other store. Alrighty, I'd say that is a pretty successful trip into town. And we got ourselves some more gas. Oops. <laughs> we want to make sure that we make sure this is refrigerated. Because if it's not cool, then it'll spoil. It's It's got to be kept clean and cold. And then, uh, oh yeah, and then we have to call the mother. You're always tinkering with your cars, eh? Don't think you like that rally. I mean, that is definitely true. And, uh, you know, a few of you asked, yes, I am still drowning my mail. I think the next step here is going to be removing all of this from the bed because uh, I want to sell one last load of wood because we got all that wood down there that we, that we cut but couldn't split. All right, well, this is probably like one tree's worth of wood, which is, I'm, I, I think this is all I'm really going to worry about. All right, let's go see how much money this brings. Oh, that was loud. That was really, really loud. But that was also $400, and I cannot complain with that. Watch the smooth drift. That's, that wasn't smooth. Tomorrow, the garage will hopefully be done. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. 
Thank you for watching. Please like the video if you like the video. Subscribe if you like me. And I will see you next week.